Tonight, a meeting was held with community members who are concerned about Amron's plan to build a 100-mile-long power line that will run from Palmyra to Kirksville. This is a huge project. It's going to affect hundreds, if not thousands of people in the area. And um, we just feel like this project hasn't been presented to landowners with enough uh, input from them. Bill DeFried and his family are just one of many families that will be affected by these power lines. It runs right across our farm, so we just bought this piece of property five years ago, and now they're going to run power lines through it. So. The community members that I've spoken to tonight say that they've seen the proposed routes for the power lines and that none of them adequately avoid their land or their neighbor's land. This, this is a big deal. We, don't, we were not going to put one of these things near a daycare center. Well, that's awfully nice of them, but uh, uh, if it's bad to be near a daycare center, it's probably going to be pretty bad to be in your backyard where you may want to have your children. An Ameren spokesperson has said that they have and will continue to hold open houses for the public to voice their concerns. People are finding that their homes and lands that they've had for years or generations are all of a sudden being proposed to have a 345,000 volt power line running through. Like four young kids, I really don't want them out in the middle of all that. It's right, right, right beside our house, so it's not a very good deal. In Kirksville, Eddie Catum, KTVO News.